Hello my friends, I'm playing with M5 stack Atom S3 but this is new version S3 Air and Air stands for rainbow and I have a few examples for it. For example this is cute win Windows logging screen. If I press I can see Carlton dancing or this guy. Yes, you are. Or this classic. But best looking is this Windows logging screen. Windows XP. Long time ago we were using this Windows. This is a cute board. And sometimes I love to use smaller boards for my ideas and for my playing let's say it that way simple esp32 s3 board with push button 0 0.85 inch display overall size of this board is very tiny less than two centimeters no less than one inch and little and 22 millimeter reset button groove connector for their sensors modules i have many of them i never showed you this one for example real real time clock or co2 sensor or solid state relay or this simple switch or this one is interesting this, this this is basically just screen so if you have older version of atom this is also m5 atom but this one have all only rgb led here so you can connect this here and now you have display but let's go back to this board which is kind of cute and it has also built-in led programmable and infrared led so you can turn on or off some something tv projector or something i'm not sure where i will use this but it was fun to make this and my friend saw this and he was really confused. <laughs> Next example I made is this black jack. I'm using this motor driver for atom boards because it has built-in battery and it can be used to drive all kind of different motors like servo motors and regular motors but in this case i'm just using to power it so this is black jack well, the point of this game is to have 21 i will choose another card another card and let's say i'm fine now the new game i need to press it press this button so i have eight another kite ten if i press another car it will be too much oh no actually <laughs> it was perfect so i can up to five cards as i said i am playing but uh, I will share you these sketches with you where you, you can use this on your desk so maybe your friends will also be confused and uh, my ideas what what else we can use this because this is s3 inside uh, s3 can act as a pc keyboard or mouse so another idea is to have this on working this and use this to 
turn on or off your PC. Another idea is to use board like this on breadboard because these atoms are really breadboard friendly. I really don't know why I used Arduino Uno so for two years. I remember hooking those long wires just to turn on LED. But that is another story. And yes, I still I, I showed you this. This is not Atom series, this is even smaller. This is probably cheapest as smallest Arduino. Uh ESP32 board, this is nano. You can see how small is it? It is practically same size like USB C. And here you have also RGB LED here, and you have push button, and you have infrared LED, I think, here somewhere. I still haven't used those. I hope you don't mind. I just wanted to make some relaxed video and uh, to show you some stuff I'm playing with. What else I have? Yes, those those boards have only one one groove connector, so you can always use this splitter, which will turn your single groove to to two of them. And here I have some sensors. I'll need to make something with those modules. This is here is also this great rotary encoder I also never used. I have so much equipment I never used. Mostly from M5 Stack and Lilygo. But I will need to find some usage for it. Thank you for your time. Thank you because you watched my Monday video without lots of editing where I just talk. Thank you. Bye.